hello everyone welcome back to my channel it's been a long time since I made actually a video I didn't have time actually be, um, because I had to do other works as well but this is obviously my garden now and I have actually moved everything from my greenhouse outside because I had really bad fungus snack problems inside so I just moved all of the cucumbers outside all of the peppers outside so these are all of my peppers these are basically this is the row of the normal sized peppers the pe uh, sweet peppers uh, bell peppers what you prefer to call it and the four pots on this front side is the Hungarian wax chili hot and these are the Anaheim chili the four on the left side so basically today I'm going to just harvest some chilies not some peppers because peppers aren't ready yet but I'm going to harvest some chilies and show you update on some gladiolus basically that is flowering here in my garden it's really windy today so everything is nearly just flopped over so it's very very windy so let me just show you when I actually harvest my um, peppers so we're gonna be begin with the um, Hungar Hungarian yellow wax hot and basically I have actually harvested some chilies before as well so this is the basic, basic the second harvest of my chilies so I got a tons of chilies so I got my harvest basket and now I'm going to just going to harvest some Hungarian wax yellow hot and then some Anaheim chilies so basically these are the Hanam Anaheim chili plants so I'm going to just harvest those chilies these actually some good size and some not but outside they are producing more better so this is the first chili basically basically I have a harvest more than that but this is how this Anaheim chili looks like it could be turned yellow um, um, sorry red if it's um, leaves too long on the plant but I'm going to not eat that um, red green is best for us we always use green chili not red so let me just harvest it before because I saw some insects eating some of my chilies that aren't ripe so I do, I'm a little bit afraid for them to eat so I'm going to just harvest the rest of them these are the other two plants here's one of the chili so there are many more actually on the plant I'm just trying to find if there are more there are more smaller ones on it but we don't need that so that's right let's go to the Anaheim chili he's with us today to harvest some chilies gonna harvest some chilies so cute boy gonna harvest some chilies Let's just harvest the rest of the chilies. So here the Anaheim chili, one of the plants. These are actually really huge plants. There are some smaller chilies, but I don't, I don't think that they're gonna get bigger. Let me just cut that. That's one of the chili. A bit weird, but that's alright. Just harvest them. Like that. I don't think they are. They aren't really hot. The Anaheim ones, but the Hungarian chili wax hot. Are pretty hot chilies. Next day I will try to grow some hotter chilies, like the um, cayenne. So let me just go to the other chilies. So here are the other two plants, and here the chilies are quite big. In this plant, I have four chilies that are quite big. I think I'll just harvest them, they won't turn red without the sunlight and I don't want obviously the um, ch plant to use all of this energy on this chili I want it to grow as well so that I can actually um, save it for, for the winter so I've got one here I want more of the chilies to actually mature so the other chilies on this plant will just mature as they grow so let me just go and harvest some more things if I can find the pretty good harvest of chilies here and uh, I am going to just um, go and see if I can harvest something more so I got a tomato here let me just see if I if that's ripe 
that was a ripe tomato my first tomato it was supposed to be bigger but I don't know why it is so big let me just put in the harvest bag let's see what else can we harvest yes mint we can harvest some mint so that it grows well for the next season I had just two strawberries hanging so I just harvested them and ate them so let me just harvest the mint the mint is looking pretty good I don't want it to form really hard stems as you know I don't like um, mint with really hard stems just cut it like that Pretty good harvest of mint as well. That's right. Let's go and harvest something else if we can find. So a quick update basically on everything that is growing. Just go to this garden and look at this beautiful gladiolus stalk. It's wilting down just because of the wind, so that is the same color here. I think that color would be red. So pretty. So I have a cabbage that is nearly ready. It's forming a head. It's being eaten by some flies, but that's alright. They want also some food, so I don't I won't complain. So this nostrum is doing really well. The others are just like really tired. That's alright. I will find a way of growing them next year. And uh, I will just harvest some seeds from those um, nostrums. So these are the radishes. It's on the flowering stage. So I can't harvest the radishes and eat them because they're not so edible yet because uh, they're on the flowering stage. I have these peas that are sowed again. As you can see, coming up nicely. I have the... Mm, turnips looking really well and I have this I forgot a cucumber plant that is actually full of um, powdery mildew so I'm gonna just throw it away I don't need that so just composted it I know it's not good to compost um, powdery mildewed plants but I just take the risk I don't care actually I have this apple tree I cut down, I pruned really hard pruned from this area. It was uh, blocking that tree and the apples couldn't get so much sunlight so I'd be harvesting many many apples. It wasn't so many apples like last year because last um, this year many of the flowers just dropped off just because of the harsh spring we had like s snow and I'm going to just cut more of this apple tree and harvest the rest of them. And as you can see, let's go into the garden and see what we have here. The radishes are just growing out of the raised bed. So I have the, um, these are called carrots. I just forgot, I don't know why. So there's a the carrots looking really well. As you can see, really happy as well. Let's go to the cucumbers which I took outside so the cucumbers are outside I know it's not the best thing uh, sorry thing to have the cucumbers outside they will have some powdery mildew issues I know that but that's right I will try to treat them because they're outside they will have some powdery mildew I did see a cucumber here that isn't ha ready to harvest but that's the one cucumber we harvest like 20 cucumbers from these eight plants when it was in the greenhouse this was so delicious I was so happy with the harvest so that was it for today and i have harvested many of the cucumbers uh, sorry the chilies and mint one tomato so i really hope you enjoyed the video and i will see you later in the next video bye